Welcome back to Bright Engineering. This is Civil Professional Room. Today's lesson is all about continuation of ACTAD basics that include drag a copy, rotate a copy, mirror a copy, drag multiple copies, rotate multiple copies, and multiply. But please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Let's open our architect, activate design, select the wall, view the default setting on info box to draw a wall here. Then deselect the wall command by clicking arrow. Then select this wall, right click, go to the move, select the drop copy, specify the starting point, then move the cursor to the right. You can specify distance, angle, let's specify our distance, that's 5000, then click enter. What you're going to see that the copy of this wall has been dragged to this position. Again, right click, then go to the move, select rotate, specify the rotating point, draw the rotating line, then start to rotate the copy of the selected wall. You can specify angle, code, and arc length. But let's make our angle to 90 degree. Then click on that position. We are going to see that the copy of this wall has been rotated horizontally. This is how the rotate, rotate copy means on architect. Again, let's select this wall. Right click. Go to the move, then select mirror a copy, then specify the position of our mirror. Let's say this one. Then you are going to see that the copy of the selected wall has been mirrored to another position. The image is formed at the same distance at the distance of object from the mirror. This is how the mirror copy means on architect. Again, let's right click, then go to the move. After that, select drag multiple copies, then specify the starting point. Let's say this one. You can specify distance and angle but the way you move the cursor to the right is the way that you're going to see the copy of the selected wall is dragged. then after attaining the position you want let's say this one then click on that position to place the first copy again move the cursor to the right and attain this position then click on on that position this is how the drag multiple copy means on architect press escape button on keyboard to finalize this command then click on empty area this is how the drag multiple copy means on architect again Let's select this one, then right click. After that, go to the move, then rotate multiple copies, then specify the rotating point, let's say this one, then draw a line here or rotating line. After that, start to rotate the wall. You can specify angle, code, and arc length. Let's say here, and then after attaining the position, click on that area. Again, keep on rotating. You're going to see that another copy of the selected wall is being rotated. Then after attaining the position you want, click on that area. Again, repeat the procedure. As you can see on, the, on your screen, this is how the rotate multiple copy means on architect. 
after ending this click on escape click on escape then click on empty area this is how the drag multiple copies means on architect again select this wall after that right click then go to the move then select multiply it is the short way to drag multiple copies rotate multiple copies and elevate here you can enter the number of copies let's select drag you can enter the number of copies let's say let's say we need we need five copies here and let's make them to to the distance apart that's five thousand no let's say ten thousand you can select increment distribute spread or distribute then after that let's select increment then click ok after that start to no sorry yeah let's keep our all here after that move then multiply yeah drag the number of copies five vertical displacement ten thousand Hmm. vertical displacement should be zero then click ok after that specify the starting point hmm. you can see if you specify the distance let's say 5000 then click continue then keep on looking that the copies of the selected wall has been dragged to the equal distance of 5000 that we have selected or that we have specified this is how the multiply means on architect you can do the same for hmm, you can do the same for for rotate elevate and matrix but you can change the increment Incre increment means the selected wall is not accounted uh, this is how the increment means distribute you can distribute them you can split them you can distribute negative it means you exclude the starting selected wall this is how the multiply means on architect keep watching for the next lecture thank you but please don't forget to subscribe like comment and share